everyone, this is your librarian, Fantastic World, letting you know that visiting hours for Hush House are now open. Welcome to the Book of Hours and, of course, Lovecraft Country. Okay, we got a bunch of stuff to consider here. Now, the storm gives a couple options. We can use this to try to regenerate our um, Ascendant Harmony by using this, or we can see if we can get somebody we can use with the heart another six heart points in order to be able to get this section out or if we're really lucky 11 to get the collapsed cellar done so what we should do at this point is figure out who we're going to be having now we still have to get the fet healed we'll get to it but first things first we will i think hit this with trist all right fortune telling nope what we want is 10 shilling nope Seek unusual help. But first of all, who do we get if we don't? Fisherman. Uh, moon. So it's two moon. Some of those do have moon, but I don't think I can generate ten moon. So yeah, let's go with unusual help. When that's going on, we can decide what we're going to read today. Now, if you notice, we're changing... Um, now we're decamping here, so in the 30 seconds, that will give us an opportunity. Also need to go feed our beast here, because as well as this larval thing, we're supposed to um, feed it with some moth energy to see what happens. So we'll need an egg. If we need eggs, we need to get them, of course, from our resident chickens. If we want to use our resident chickens, we're going to use them one at a time. I guess we use metal here, tuppence. All right, spend some time with the beastie and give him that. We'll offer an egg in return. All right, so while that's happening, to get an egg to start dealing with this issue, we can also check this out. Now, I want to see if I can use the damaged vet, which I cannot use. Oh, well. But it will, if I use a soul card, give us something there. Now, I'm not quite sure what I want to use today. We still have to use chore, for example, to activate the, um, the bed we'll be taking, which is going to actually be Eva's. And also, the only other one that was used by a, um, the DeWolf. Um, another one used by another librarian. Now, Eva, um, of course, is the femme fatale of the, of the organization, but I just think, all right, this is one of my favorite, but this is probably also my favorite, uh, second favorite, but, whew, looks nice. Self-born, furry, cloven, looking hoof, foot, reaches towards a mirror, its reflection is a bird claw. That's an interesting contrast on that. Actually, let's get this. All right. We've got, oh. This goes in, we can't hear the weather as well. But yeah, we've got um, the bed, which is going to be used for Grail, which is going to be used for this to get fed up, and we'll need Chore for that, but we'll need Chore to get actually in the bed. We can use Whist, however, when we can, when we want, in order to be... We're going to... Well, let's see how that works. It could be the decamping that's causing an issue. Use a matching soul card to move your belongings and make this your bed. Well, we'll get there. In any case, simultaneously. Hmm. Let's see how that works in a bit. In any case, the decamping will occur, and I'm not sure what we're going to be reading today. I mean... Oops, up here. Oof. We could just keep going with the Grail stuff. That seems to be doing us well. But again, we don't... We'd have to use the Grail card. Next one up would be... Rose. Now, I think Wendy says Rose. I don't remember you. Fett has Rose. Ha ha ha. Could use it though. All right. So we know this this board has Rose since it's a map related one. We put in Fett and we put in this one. Rose wandering. It gives us one Rose so far. We need another powerful Rose. This one. That's three. Do we have anything that's higher than that? Sky stories? Probably not. So this would be a total of three. Hmm. Probably we should wait until we get that at full power. It'll be much easier. This one, also Grail, which we're going to need elsewhere. Another Grail. Six, though. The Locksmith's Dream. That is Shapt. Now, if we do this Shapt, we can't use it for any of our alchemy, which has been highly successful of late. But we could do, in fact, we may want to just, let's see, eight Ector. We got, I'm thinking it may be, we'll just skip the book for the day. 12 and, I know I can type that one up, but let's get this one. 12, okay, so we're gonna skip the book for today, at least reading one. What we're going to do is we're going, is the dispensary. Now, I think 
if we get a one, yeah, we get the memory, it's two, two, and that, plus the shaft, yep, we need to get one memory of pattern, which we get for using just verse. Just verse is located here. Okay, if we use just verse, we need to look at this at some point. Figure out what it is. We use just verse with, well, let's use forge. Don't, don't think we'll be using that a lot today. Forge and just verse, and that will allow us to get pattern. Then that will get, we can use that to create another glass finger, which of course has proved extraordinarily useful in this game. Okay, so the health though, I'm thinking probably just gonna be, I think one of these has a winter aspect that I can draw from. Like I can't, this one I think, blue crown. I think I have some blue crown already and I'm trying to make not hoard more than two of any particular ingredient at any one time. Where is it? Ah, there it is. I think this is blue crown right here. It is, we don't need any more blue crown. We could use is some random stuff. It's, we need some beach sand. All right, so grab health, grab this, have fun. All right. Now let's see who we get for our um, random helpage here. We'll get the shaft started so we can get or start use, replacing all the stuff we used up. And again, storm will depend entirely on what we uh, get for a possible helper. Hmm. Now, this has moth, so we can use that to try to raise this thing up, which would be kind of interesting. It's got to be meat products or an egg, and we're developing the egg, so we should be fine. I mean, uh, Oz. Decamp. They are currently decamped. Excellent. I actually... Julian Crosby and Solomon Hush are both great witches. Which witches slept in this bed, although not simultaneously. Hey. No one, the story runs every mansion's three night in it since. Hey, I have been sleeping there for like, well, no, technically I haven't. I've just technically been claiming it's mine, but let's go to Eva's lovely little place here. Very winter. Use a matching soul card to move your belongings in. What's wrong with this one? Has to be Faust? All right. We gotta wait though on that one because if this is in case Foss is the only one we can use, which is kind of weird, has to be Guy. All right, that's it. Other possibility is simply to regenerate Foss, this Foss, to come back through here. We'll probably do that if we can't use the storm. So yeah, we're still waiting on our potential visitor here. Oh, stat. I mean, uh, what would you call it? Uh, temporary worker. Yes, this is probably this place is probably the equivalent of the um those fly by night um employment companies. God, I remember having to do that for a few for a couple of months between jobs. It was just regular jobs. It was just so horrible. We did it. So boring. All right, the poet. This actually could be useful if we can get um guy moth. All right, collect moth is something we can definitely use. You, on the other hand. There we go, hen's egg. But what happens if I put you here, put you there? Wait, the food? Wait, it can't be the remains. All right, so that would be for you, but... All right, I kind of want to know what this does, and also I'm somewhat terrified to find out. But I think I read it wrong. You have to have... Let's give you some veggies. No interest in food right now. All right, what happens if I put this in? It has no interest in food. Oh, wait. Moth? Fine with the beastie. Huh. I thought... It... We need to think carefully about this. Let's... Skip that. It's not... Happy. Um... So the poet. Oh, which one are we doing first? Wait. Now, the poet can get us into some of these places. There's winter is definitely... That's in that direction. You can also clear out, no, down here. Now it does, we have the crypts here for 15, but oh my God, I don't know how I can do 15. I can count it up. We can use flowers with him. The flowers, and I, we do have up to one winter, unfortunately only, but it'd be six, sorry, five, four, five. Like this one right here. You'll notice that all of them, blue rose. No, blue rose is two, two crown is two winter. Okay, can we do this? Six with this, 
Husher preparation gives us. Let's see. Husher preparation gives us another four. So that would be ten plus three and two. We can do this. But this also has nothing to do with the storm, which means we are definitely going to be using it for um so we need the um we need okay, we have to add this all up. But first of all, yeah, we're not gonna be redoing this for a bit, but let's get the poet. Let's give him the 10 shilling. Yeah, we're kind of pushing things here. Meanwhile, pattern. All right, so we don't want to waste the pattern. So what we want to do... What the heck? Yeah, things are adding up here. Hmm. The larva and the book. All right, so let's um, let's clear the clutter. I don't want to lose track of these things again. Um, and we, it's too busy today, however, to do so. But let's stick them... Someplace I'm unlikely to forget them. Over here. Since I use this table a lot. Alright, so that. Let's do this. We'll pick up these up. Figure out where to put that. Put the box back. We definitely put the vegetables back. I think. Hmm. We know where to find the vegetables if I need them. Okay. The egg, on the other hand, needs to be eaten by this thing, but we'll do that at the end of the day. We've still got the egg, though. Meanwhile, yeah, we got a lot of work to do here. But anyways, let's get the pharmaceuticals done, at least. Pharmaceuticals. Boom. Dispensary. Liquid. Flour. Memory pattern. Um. Soul. Adapt. That's eight. And door and wall. It's finger tucks and... Hit it, baby. Alright, so that's going on. Now we gotta figure out if we can create the music. We need ten. There's the music room. We need ten. This off right off the bat is six. Skill. Let's see. Oh, if we've got one. Work. Level three. I don't see, unfortunately. Swings and songs. Blended harmony. Yep, bingo. We do not need anything in addition. Just the storm, strings and song, and fast. All right, hit it. Blended harmony. We won't be changing out beds today unless... Oh, gods. Need to regenerate that. But the only one to do so would be another fast, a sky-based one. So what we need... All right, it's going to kind of suck, but... Rest and refreshment, three pence. There we go, we get another penny out of it at least. That will allow us to change out later. Okay, meanwhile... Let's get the poet moving. Oh, I'm definitely going to need... Uh, foresight. We can actually... Oh, God, damn, let me remember this time to uh, read the journal. Okay, get just first in there. Okay, the journal... Will have to be read, I think, with this one wrist here. It's a journal here. That should, let me double check, give us force. Oh, foresight's not the right one, unfortunately. Oh, the journal gives me, yeah, forge. I want foresight, not, um, I want hindsight, not foresight. Okay, so get that out. Winter 2 would be introduction to histories, which we do have up here. Introduction to histories. Yep, bingo. Nothing more. That will give us... And put this back. That will give us... Put it... Ah, there you go. That will give us a... um Two points, which would be plus the... Which would give us two points, which plus the... um Whisk is a five. So let's get that started. All right. Deep breath. A chore is inaccessible at the moment, unless we manage to... Actually, yeah, we should be doing something with this. Um, uh, do we want wood? Possibility. Um, we could get more water. I mean, there's got to be something we can do with this. I'll figure it out. Probably just, we can use it. We'll use it for money, I'm thinking. I mean, I'd love, if we can get it to work, I don't know. Meanwhile. Yeah, put that back together. You. I'm going to use my soul to help you gain more frost. Okay. Um, sure. 
Hmm. Waiting on a couple of things here. Like I said, the distillery is currently going. Very slowly. We will get our Ascended Harmony back much faster because we have a higher skill level, at the very least. And the next time around, we can use the dispensary. We can use this to get a um, the confusing knock memory. It seems to work. Ah, where are you? We got the beach sand, which is good because we can use that to create the the metal. Because remember, we used up all of our sand. We need to. I can't believe I happy about sand. I used to be absolutely hateful about this, but we actually have a sand. We actually have a sand shelf now. <sighs> Meanwhile, all right then, you're currently at seven. Good. We're waiting for the memory to get done. Can I interest you in a drink? Or say? Actually, no, let's give him the flowers because, oh my god. I have so much of this sea stuff, and I'm about to get more, so I keep going. Uh, there you go. Ah, fading flowers of inspiration. Now, we need the uh, 2.1 up there, the blue stuff. Give me a moment. I'll be right with you. All right. Yes. Blue crown. That'll give him two additional winter, which we need to give him everything we can. Be up to nine now. Excellent. By all means, stare at the flowers and be inspired. You're a poet. I know how you work. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> yeah, I should use Chore and I think Coco would be able to get this fest back to normal. Which is probably what we'll do. Yeah, meanwhile. Alright. Foss is up and running. Why do I have Foss? Because I want this bed, damn it. It's a nice bed. Didn't realize there's only one of these I could add to Max. Camping in the bed. Go for it. I'm about to be risque as an other uh, librarian. Inside it is. That will be next. Oh, excellent. He's done. He's at 10. Now, 11. And then the house home separation makes him 15. We can choose our crypt. And I, I'm actually wondering. We know this crypt is tied with the lovers here. Marble. Look, I can't actually use that seal vault. It's going to have to be this one. Right. Not a problem. Fluttering crypt it is. I didn't even realize that. 14. Huh? Going to take a bit. With treble motor and uh, triple lock. Yep, it's definitely the sisters. All right. So, glass finger toxin. Excellent. Now placing our losses, as it were. Next time around, we'll probably get another one of the juice boxes. Send in harmony. If we need a four point, we got it. Go. Wow. And we're waiting for this to camp in, as well as getting the poet up and running so we can get our fluttering crypt. The darkness here beats with wings. Bats sound like birds, where there's a triumphant quality that suggests more bones and feathers. One more step, and I sense the possibility of talons. I'm sending the poet in first. He's more expendable. Solomon's preparations. All right, there we go. Glad we made this stuff. I had to figure out how to make this stuff. 15. Oh, wow. We really spiked him up. Also, I will place the Solomon's preparations with the extra one we have here. Let's see, where is it? Ah. Yep, there it is. Trying to keep up with this stuff. Okay, lefty, uh, no, Solomon Separations goes here. Among the more hardcore situations. Okay. There we go. 15 it is. Unlock it for me. Oh, finally. They can give you the... I can finally feed my beast... Got the slot open. Okay. Suitable sustenance. All right. Oz. I have to use both? All right. Safe place for me now, and to the extent that dreams are safe. Well, yeah, dreams can be potentially really freaking dangerous. Pure humility. We need... Grail. All right. So, give me this. Give me Grail. 
Ah, I see stories. I need to hit a beverage. Or, I'm actually kind of curious. I noticed the fresh linen has the same recovery thing. I don't think it's actually going to work, but you never freaking know. There it is, it right there. Basket of clean linen. There it is. Don't even need to use a drink. Just need some fresh sheets. Let's get this fast working again, shall we? Have a good night's sleep, as it were. Uh, we are definitely getting low on cash. We've got to hold out until spring when we're uh, when we're um, paid. But don't worry. First thing tomorrow, you get fed. Try not to take off my like my face in the meantime. Well, technically, doesn't that recharge this one? I could do some. I could feed you with that if I have the time. Although three minutes into the future, and frankly, I fallen in love with this bed. Really have. You know. Eva's Boudoir. I'm also going to access to this, which is going to be interesting. And this. It's probably flooded, though. We have to use one of these to get it open. Alright. There we go. The crypt is open. Yeah, this one, 1414. Another sealed vault. And this one's rattling tunnels. The dead do not walk here with their eyes upon me. I can quell them or feed them. <coughs> Only the poet again. Not the same sort of mix up there. But yeah... Take a look at it. Columbic Crypt. St. Columba, the self-companions, brought the word of the unconquered son to Scotland. Ah, oh, screw it. It's a Patrick analogy. Where he founded a monastery in the Blessed Isle of Ono. Basically took over the Sisters, the Triple Knots facility, and then immediately turned it, uh, put his own temple on top of it, you know, with his masculine energies over the to claim that he's defeated the feminine energies. Bloody hell. Then he died, and his bones remained here until the Northmen came. But in Cornwall, I speak of his 13 companions, a hybrid beauty called Rowena, we know her, we know said perhaps his tutor, perhaps his seducer, perhaps his daughter, or, you know, any combination of the three. At his death, the monks brought her to stone her for impurities. She bore up Columbia's bones away so the monks would not have them, substituting out of tact to the bones of a horse. She brought the bones to a hidden isle where she made a double foundation of nuns and monks. To become the first abbess, but she would admit none but her order as a virgin or innocent of every crime. This the isle has been a refuge of the world, might computer impure. The order... None to her order who was a virgin nor innocent of any crime. They had to be guilty. But remember, we looked back up here. There's Rowena. Right there. That's her desk. See? And I wait. This is Rowena's desk. Nona? Oh. Oxley Scholar Dancer. Never mind. Nona is a later one in which um, he was obviously impure woman who danced for a uh, living. But, you know. St. Brandon's, the trial, Abbas Nona, who's probably the Persians of Healing Arts. So basically, yeah, she founded the dual nature one here, but huh, nice of the men to eventually kick out the uh, females, because again, this is his damn fight over the zone. But this appears to be the only interactable item, and yep, eater of flesh, no bones remain, the marble is chilly with power. So basically, yeah, we can use this to sacrifice either with winter or moth, Soul, skill, memory, plus remains. So it's another death font of power. It's a thing that we have, but steel bolt, right? But we're going to have to break through some of these other ones to get where we want to go. Now, if we ever get the poet again, we can get to the silent hall. Clear this zone out. And yeah, I could have gotten this one easy, but, you know, one thing at a time. You know. So I'm not going to disturb the dead. I'm not going to be angry at him. But his daughter did attempt to do better, but, um, yeah. Hmm. Interesting, you have a, she founded, basically the place is a refuge for anyone that the world considers to be impure. But unfortunately, the purifiers came and they dumped their stuff on top of it. And then kicked out all the women they consider to be impure. Cycles of history. All right, so what else do we have running here? Okay, so where's the bed? Okay. Oof, it's going to take a while. Eh, we've got nothing else going. We probably should speed it up next day. And see what happens. Alright. What do you want for it? Just one? Twin Serpent Tantra? I guess. Just want one. Right, yeah. Good thing we sold... Good thing we acted as a prostitute for the fairies. It was definitely profitable. And it's written in Sanskrit, which we can actually take care of. Alright, excellent. 
Excellent. This book is very reasonably priced. But in the meantime, yeah, we got this. 41 seconds remaining on the bed. That will probably recharge, but the chore will be undone. Uh, we definitely need to feed you. But let's get the beast fed here. Just want to know. But it won't any sustenance card. It won't take remains. Or no interest. So it basically, I want to see if this happens. Because it said we are supposed to do it with moth ability. So I, I know I should be feeding you, but we'll get to you. Gonna be kind of an overworked thing. In the meantime, of course, we need to know who we're gonna be possibly working with today. We'll toss in metal. And the crown. Ugh, gods. Oh, we're always slowing down as the money runs out. Um Can consider the book, but which book do we want? Grail one's out as our primary is gone. We can read this. It's a rose book, though. We can't do that. Yeah, the rose one's still under. This one... We need six now. Oh, wait. What's our weather card for the day? We probably know that. Come on. No. Okay. So, snow... Kind of an interesting thought about that. In order to create... Um, if we get the poet again, the snow's going to work really hard towards getting us the rattling tunnels up and going. Which looks kind of interesting here. And we also have access to another sealed crypt. But yeah, we're going to have a lot of range in this here, but that would definitely be worth it. Meanwhile, also, if we don't have him, we've got to have a winter one. Yep. Winter. Eatery after. We definitely can, of course, use Wist plus that to bring six plus another that. Yeah, it's going to be easy enough to do. Definitely need to figure out how to get you, uh, Alive. I like the fact that this is stasis kind of going on for this world. I think Hush House has an eternal stasis going with it. Anyways, but yeah, the snow, sky, yeah. We can definitely use it for a book if we can't use it for a person. In the meantime, let's see about this, because I definitely want to figure out what's going on with this thing. I thought it was a little moth energies and then something else, but no, it didn't work. Maybe we're supposed to use it with um, combos inside of one of the cage or something. It's a possibility. Now let's take a look at it. All right. So, all right. So, yeah. Chores fatigued. That's fatigued. Uh, this is fine. We'll have to get that. What the heck? All right, then. We'll get that cleaned in a bit. But... Nice bed. Anyways, what else we got? Hmm. Get this one knocked out. Give me kind of a low effort day. It's winter after all. Alright. Consulting engineer. Lantern, Forge, and that. So it's a completely different kind of combo here going. It's definitely not going to work with our thing here. Okay, now it comes... Now it, we suggest a meal will be welcome. Memory, Fear. Okay. Not really super useful. But we now know what it does. And... Let's feed this one first. We did promise it first. Have the egg... Oh, the effort card. Um, sure. Actually, let's uh, do that first. Now, we are going to be using the snow card. Put this one back for the moment. Grab this. Okay. Getting us to do read it, which should be rather easy. Need this, plus the snow, plus... That gives us six. Now, let's see. We could, there, we could definitely do it with an ink or a skill. So, our best bet might be to simply read the, um, which one was it again? Winter two, right. 
Direction to history is to get the appropriate skill. All right, so direction to history should be located here. And hmm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Got a direction to histories. Grab this. That will give us a 2.1. And we'll definitely be able to crack the new book. In the meantime, let's see about what we're going to do about Shapt. Now, with Shapt, okay, we'll need to get. Kind of curious. Need to get another pattern memory in order to pull this off, which we're going to have to use that metal to do so. Meanwhile, with health, we want to go out again? Don't know yet. It's kind of a recovery day today. And if worst comes to worst, we'll use up the shaft in order to create another juice bottle. In case we don't need it for anything else. Hmm. <laughs> Odd, though. Oh, right. The engineer, though. Do we have anything we can use for her? No forge or lantern or... Yeah, I don't think there's a lot here. And especially... Ooh, 12. Okay. Can we do this? 12? Hmm. Wing Haunted Cave. How do we do it? Well, first of all, we, she can use metals. That's five right off the bat for the oraclum, which we can replace. Especially with the glass figure toxin available. Then we'd have, I think, one of the teas. This one? Evening Isles Coffee? No. Which one is it? It's one. Anything else? Thought we had a two pointer here somewhere. Check over here. One point. One point. One point. I thought I had a beverage for that. Hmm. Oh, is that it? That's even now's coffee. Hmm. Okay, so if that's the case, do we have any two pointers up here? These liquids. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Veiled Goddess, yep, that's two. Okay, that's two, plus five is seven, which is going to be plus your four is eleven. I need three more. That's easy enough to do. We've got two here, and oh, we'd have to be, and the tool. Yep, we can do it. All right, so let's hire. Her. Oh, gods, so low in cash. Oh, I can't do it anyways. I can't. I'm talking to somebody else. I'm feeding the beastie. I can't deal with you at the moment. So we can't use the metal, so we can definitely use the health for something, though. Hmm. Probably to, uh... Right. Let's grab... We'll have to get this one and have them generate an egg and feed that one. And, oh my god, I didn't realize this was going to have a bottleneck here. Hmm. And read the book with Wist. Again, that'll give us these three. Shaps we use to generate a juice box, if nothing else. Uh, could be nothing else at this point. And then move on with our lives. Okay. So. Oh. Excellent. Now. All right. We've got hindsight in place. We've got... Beast is a helpful friend. Excellent. So who's next? Well, first of all, we are going to be doing the engineer. We need to start by paying them. This is going to take up a lot of our stuff. All right. Meanwhile, we'll grab the book here. The A, bring that over to here. And what do we got? The A there. Winter here. Oh, right. I'm an idiot. You're not an idiot. You just forgot you just skill. <laughs> All right. Skill, not... Bleh. Brain dead. I'm brain dead. Where is it? Winter stories. Right? No stories. That's it. Conclusion. Silly me. I didn't have to get this next memory, but it happened. Alright, so we'll begin reading this. Just a reminder. The book is... 
Nam's erotic novel occasionally claimed to have been written by Eva DeWolf, even though those two duels were fought in her honor to avenge the slander. Weird. This is really, the synchronicity around this is getting kind of strange. Last episode, we had, once I opened up the temple to the triple goddess, three worshippers of the goddess, including a fey lady who taught us the secret language to unlock the book that would give us the secret signs of the sisterhood within it, another one which we would have used to open up a room, but I didn't have time to do so, and another one that um, gave us, a, I mean, this taught us, that gave us, I mean, it's just weird. Now we have Eva moving into her place and then find, reading a book by her just by pure chance. I didn't plan that. Yeah, I'm Getting to think synchronicity can affect video games. Now, um, I've got two skills I'm just not using, however. I mean, two memories I just won't be using. Ugh, my sucker threadeth over. All right, so, right. We're going to need that. The Faust, on the other hand. Ugh, none of these match together, unfortunately. Oh, well. do 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 Just get this Shapt uh, juice bottle going. All right, so, Shapt. Okay, I don't think I can, I think. Yeah, I don't have enough, actually. It's only four. And none of these are going to have any that in it, so... Bit of a waste. So, you know what we can do? God damn it, we need cash. Get in there. Do some fixing and mending. I cannot believe we... No, we need to put this key over here. I didn't realize we hadn't at this point. All right, you go there. You... Got you now. All right, so first things first. The replaceable stuff we'll do first. We'll collaborate, bring up to six. All right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Health. You know what? Might as well. Hit it. Do some beach coming. He's on the fast. And some skills I wasted, unfortunately. Oh, well. We need the Foss for cash. Definitely desperately need cash. Alright, so. Six. Alright, next thing. Fuck, and we'll need spanners, I believe. Or do we use a Darity lens? A Darity lens gets us up to an eight. And then we combine that. We only need another six for that. We combine it. No, I don't think it's really necessary. What we need to do is give her the metal at this point. We can start picking it up. Okay, the metal forge is here. You had you were able to use this last time. Oh boy. Is it six? What can we max her out to be? You had... Oh, it's... She doesn't use metal? Only the other guy does. Oh, we have a problem here. Can we do this? Get her up to eight, I suppose. Um, with the T. Another two with a skill. I mean, with a, um... Foresight one, that would be... Ten? Then we have to use the two, the Dirty Lens for another two, and then what we do? Hmm. I don't think we have fuel. We can give her fuel. Do we have any, how much fuel do we have that's... This isn't a fuel, is it? Because it'd be, yeah, it is. Oh my god. Brings up to 11. Stuck it down. Hmm. A little odd, but we can do that. That's 11. We can give her a spanner for 12, and then we give her a memory. That's going to be really inexpensive to do. So what we need to do is crack this baby open, do this, and finally read the damn journal. Journal of the Wolf. All right. Let's double check that. All right. Pause. Everybody pause for a minute. All right. D Wolf, the journal. Yep. Forge 2. So that we'll, And then we'll actually... I'll actually read it this time. Why that's going on. Excellent. Oh, well, you know, a little better. A little 60, 24... Oh, right, and this book. Ah, excellent. We'll have to go put that into our collection. Good introduction to histories. Done over here. Hmm, I thought we... Do we have... Does she have any shelf space down here? 
does not. She's not a big reader. Okay, so... Right then. This under eights. I think. Yeah, there we go. A lot of eights. Okay. Introduction to histories. We can put that over here. And they're not... Okay, you can go back to your place. You like it in here, and I like you not being near me. Get in there. Thank you. I don't know what that is, but it freaks me out. Okay, so we'll have to get the whole hen thing here. Oh, wait. No, we can't. All right. Do, 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 do. Then we give her the spanner for a total of 12. And that Xanathok essence, we can just make tons of it. Awesome. 11. Get you the spanner. Borrow our tools. Where are our tools? Up here. Do 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 do. Boom. In there. Tools. Brings you up to 12. And we'll give you the memory, and that will be that. Okay. So strange. I do not like that thing. Hmm. Good for Moth, though. I think this one. Fire. You are a beast, right? Nope, you're... Has to be cooperative. Anyways, that would be six. That would be... All right, hang on a second. All right. Excellent. Put the tools back. Wait, actually, just wait for the memory to complete while we're doing that. Do, 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 do. All right. Excellent. Ah, more beach sand. Again, not going to complain. It is, after all, going to be useful in constructing that metal. Oh, it's getting dark. All right. Novel graphically depicts Madame Etchery's various imprisonments, ravishments, and escapes in the Devotch Commonwealth with tinctures its neighbor, the Pious Aramid. This is actually based off of a series of no two novels by um, Marquis de Sade, who actually is the root of the word sadism, because he wrote about um, ravishing women against their will non-consensually, but ironically he has two of them, called Justine and another book, I can't remember at the back, which show that the innocent virgin Justine and the wanton lustful woman of the other one don't actually have the storybook endings in which Justine is devastated and tra traumatized from her ex, why the lusty woman has a really great time. Now, this is obviously from an extraordinarily depraved individual and still accessible, by the way, um, who is a historical figure that, like I said, contributed his name to the BDSM community and other aspects, but... Um, what exactly else we know about him besides his reading is not really hugely known. I mean, Neil Gaiman is of the opinion that he's just, he was all talk. Um, and I had nothing to prove either way. So, this is actually a replication of that. Um, it's apparent that many of the Itteries, Jones, Lovers and Pursuers, Catwink, Houses, Nigwell, are transparent allegories for inks, and the Ettery is an embodiment of knowledge pinned to paper that are mingled delight and dismay. The author only half commits to the metaphor, though, is clearly is interested in titillation as revelation. So yeah, it is one of the ways that alchemists... Ooh, one of the way alchemists um, disguise their... You know, I could just... Ooh. I can actually pull this off, though, is the question. I don't know if I have enough time. I have to regenerate one of these. Probably the winter one. I don't think I can do... I've got, no, I've got Wist here. Give them two pence, and we can possibly use that... Well, I won't feel I wasted it anyways. Get it. But, yeah, Malcolmus would, make, make, would transmit information in metaphor, so it... So people who were censoring them would not, in fact, have... after Would not, in fact, have... Um, be able to understand it, because they tend to be quite thick. Alchemists, for example, use metals for states of... Uh, 
spiritual reality. Okay, fine. Walter, though nominally siding with the parliamentarians, managed to stay out of war, but in 1642, his son Brian runs away the night of his 16th birthday and joins the Royalist Army. He's captured and returned to his father, who pleads for mercy and gives his parole for his son's good behavior. In 1648, Brian runs away again, joining the Royalist Uprising. Walter runs of news that Brian has been seen on the field of battle at Keir Camp, but his fate is unknown. Walter writes one last entry about his fear for his son and the future of his family. The journal ends the excessive amount of Walter's collaboration with the architect Realock and his useful esoteric information. So, Walter. Do we have a Walter yet? Eva. Valentine. Cat. Walter. Walter DeWolf, Gideon DeWolf, but you'll notice, like, is this the third Baron though? Let me check. Yep, fifth Baron, third Baron. Where's the fourth Baron? Give me a moment. That's fifth Baron, fourth Baron. So we gotta find his son, which was Brian. If we find a Brian, we'll put him there. Take all this. All right, talk to you about Foresight. That's 14. Definitely get that place open now. Okay, meanwhile, we'll just move the cat, because cats like to move. I really want the cat to get on this desk. That is the natural spot for cats. Fine, but the table is good. Just don't eat the duckling. Oh my god. Are you considered furnishing? All right, apparently. If that's the case, where can we stick you? You know what? You might like it down here. Okay, fine. We'll put you back on this on the uh, counter. Uh, of course, they're giving me trouble. They're a cat. Back there. You get Brian, though. You're going to have to move. Okay. So that was actually useful to learn. Brian, if we find him. I mean, we've still got to find these damned, uh, bus, as it were. I mean, they're probably staring me right in the face. Is that Brian? That's Natalia. Okay. This is... We don't know. Um. Alright then, you're at 14. Let's see, I believe... Where is it? Yeah, there it is. Okay, drunken world of bats. I'll be back. Freshly, perhaps lily drunken. There's a faint, definitely brandy smell. So we're going to have more wine cellar? Oh my god. Maybe it's a wine press. That would be actually awesome. I know, we've got so many things I've just not been doing properly. All right, so... 15 seconds. We'll create another ink thing. We'll have to decide what we're going to use for the third one. Uh, dust will come soon. We always say that. All right. Boom. Take this. Recollect. Put this. All right. Put this here. It means we can't use the sweetest second uh, lesson, which we're not going to be able to pull off. So, I mean, so, we can only use one of these anyways. We might as well find a level one that we want to increase. That's winter. This is moon. Let's see. Winter and moon. Winter or moon. Winter or moon. That's the language. Winter or moon. Winter or moon. There. Oroscopy. That's one. Winter or moon. Winter. Ooh, definitely this one. This one has been actually quite useful. In, uh, creating the uh, bonage, as it were. Creating the remains. There we go. At least we're not going to waste the, uh, uh, waste anything. Well, we are going to waste the memory fear, but, you know, got to figure out how to get those larvae to uh, increase. But we'll be getting this relatively soon, too. And we're going to be opening this section. Hopefully get this one here and connect in either direction. So, hey, curious. The absolute bottom is all the dead. All the dead are underground because that is where the underworld is. One day I'm going to have to go over the symbology of the, of the underworld feminine energy and the masculine, um, uh, higher realms energy up here with the living quarters, which are the middle realms in the world. Representing the living world. Bingo. Hint, rhyme, and remembrance. Ah, excellent. Okay. Let's get the room unlocked. That's going to be quite of the day. Alright, cool. Smuggler's Den. The last 
year of the 18th century, the wolf line ended the estate in stately empty. Enterprising smugglers had rumors of ghosts that walked the aisle and quietly brought their tea, brandy, and tobacco. That's why we're all finding it down here. The old mines in the seaward side of the aisle, but the remnants here are newer than the 18th century. Perhaps if the curia, after, even after the curia takes possession, they permitted the smugglers to use this place. Ambrose Westcott did love this bakey, so perhaps even a special bureau found the smugglers useful enough to turn a blood eye. All right, so we have a smuggler's stand. We got, of course, another hurricane lamp, which can have its use. God, more liquid. We're going to... All right, off screen, I am... Oh, and we've got Forsaken Packages. And, yeah. Create a surprise. we got a lot of stuff to go over this one, but... Gaping Darkness. Hmm, it's going to be pretty easy. Thunder prowls entrance cave. A dying curse or a Christian storm period. It must be dealt with carefully. All right. So, yeah, we're going to... Oh, we almost got the whole episode done here. Wow. Longer than I thought it was going to be. Um, yeah... We need a moment to do some reorganizing. Hang on. All right, then. Now we're back. Now, let's see. It's practically dawn at the moment, so we have to wait a couple minute or so. I don't think anything else is running. I'll lose the memory fear, but I don't have anything to do with it. And oh my god, my money is really down there. All right, we're going to take like a break day. This one's going to be us basically trying to catch up, like getting the animals fed and dealing with some supplies and regenerating um, the other persistent memory we managed to locate. It's going to be a busy day, but it may not be a lot of, you know, a lot of mental work there. All right, so dawn comes. We've still got the lesson. This is persistent memory. And I think I might be increasing something other than what's listed. Gale. All right, so we've got three. Gale gives us trees, Bren, Walls Creek, Traveler's Bend, Low Against the Blast. I like it. Three heart and three sky. Now, the first thing we have to decide is what we're going to do with this thing. Now, obviously, I could try to work towards getting some of these hearts going, but, and I don't need it for the Ascended Harmony, but that's really not going to be helpful. The question is, do we have a book that we can use with it? Because I'd like to know what we're doing. Like, this one is obviously a sky one, but it may be the only sky one we have, and 18 is not a number I can actually... Whoa, is this one... No, this looked like it was doing it. Yeah, that's it. We got an 18. Or we've got a 12. I think the Invisible Opera. Can we actually do that one? All right. So let's check this one out. We've got Faust of 2. We've got Gale of 3. So that's going to be a total of 5 when it comes between uh, that. The biggest sky one we have for our skills is Skylings and Songs, which is a four. So four, three, four, three, two is nine of twelve. So now we need to know if we've got, oh no, we're going to have a two point, we're going to have a two point ink, aren't we? Scargle ink. Okay, so we'd have to do the whole thing again. We're hopefully going to be able to uh, get this going. Now, one of the things we can do is we can always have the Ascendant Harmony to throw in, but that's really not going to be a lot helpful. Um, because we're basically wasting it for the... Uh, I mean, it's... Silly me. The thing is, I could put the Ascendant Harmony in. The Ascendant Harmony would be 4 points, plus the Fossil 2 points, plus the 4 points, 4 strings, which would be 10, and the ink is 2. Then we have to turn around, use, regenerate next time, um, we'd have to turn around, regenerate Faust, um, that we're going to be using during this, to get the Gale back. Now, getting the Gale back, let's see. Now, this one will give us, again, another 4. This Faust would give us 1, Sky, so that'd be 5. Three there, eight. We'd have to figure out two more memories. I mean, it would be expensive. So the question is whether or not we risk losing the harmony, because we have tool, wall, art. We have a lot of things that could work. So, yeah. Let's not blow the Ascendant Harmony unless it's absolutely necessary, which means this one, I think, is Sky, right? Nope. Which one's Sky? All right, so it's going to be the Eva de Wolf. Franklin Brancroft and Ido Wolf. I'm really thinking the bed that we're sleeping in because it's Eva's has had some serious play. In gratitude for closing of the winding stair. Nocturne's secretary. Interesting. That's in Lectern. Yeah, the thing is, that was the winding stair that we reconnected back over here to get into this spooky house. All right, that's just ridiculous. I think that's the winding stair. No, it's stair Tenbris. I don't know, maybe we haven't actually found it yet. 
But the, the nocturnal house put this place on lockdown, which is ones we've been doing one by one to uh, get that. But in any case, however, let's get this. Oh, wait, I can't. Obviously, I need to put it up here. And that's the thing. I can't use. Oh, this is simple. All right, so. Weird. It is considered a memory, but it's kind of useless. I'm not going to blow up for that. We have the Gale and the Ascendant Harmony. Then throw in the skill. Uh, strings and songs. It gives us to 11. Throw in the lower level Faust. And then get the bleeding record. Harmony. Okay, well, you know, I ain't going to look a gift wind in the mouth. So this is going to be our thing. We're going to get this puppy going. And we'll regenerate the Ascendant Harmony as soon as we can, but in situations like that, it's freaking useful. So, get that knocked out. Okay, a little light listening. Now, other things to consider. Hmm. Two. Ten. Can that actually be done? Wist is three. We have Solomon's Preparation, which is four right there. That's seven total without having to add by itself. That would be skill two points would be nine. And I think we have do what we have or that we not have candles at one point. Alright, snowflake candle. Make your own joke. Alright, so um right then. Now, I need Shapt. It's to be kind of a waste, unfortunately. But it would allow us to be able to unlock the Blackened Yard. And I do want Dear Timothy, I would use his real name now because I'm being serious. I want Timothy to see what his peeps been doing. Because remember, Timothy is part of the Church Unconquered, and Church Unconquered is part of the Calatria, which is the repressive um, organizations, including the Suppression Bureau, that is attempting to prevent magic from being accessed by the common person, all, of course, because it's for a greater good. You know, the heat is scorched, melted the stones, bridge there, there are mostly people happen to be standing. Ugh, God, Charles Grack. Yeah, I wanted to see this stuff, plus it is appropriate for a holy man to sanctify a place of mass murder and dark magic like that. So your ass is getting out of here. Anyways, so, yeah, we'll have to use Foss, because we're going to need Shap. Well, actually, let's get the other Shapt idea going first. Now, with Shapt, what I'm thinking is the dispensary. What we need for here, or possibly elsewhere, we need Shapt, we need Eek Summon Old 4 that gives us. Wait, we only have three. Where's the four one? Oh, sigh. Four wall. I mean, three is good. Can't use the meter for this one, unfortunately. So, yeah, I guess this one would have to do. This plus the Glass Finger Toxin. Hmm, huh, it's not gonna work. Next level, but we have nine. Well, obviously, it's not what it's intended to be. All right. That's eight. So, basically, a two-point memory. No? Okay, so door wall would work. Ah, that's what we need. We need terminal, what am I thinking? You go threshold. Ah, uh, memory. Um, yeah. If I use a memory. The thing is, I can't use... I, if I'm going to have to use a memory, it's going to have to be a two-pointer anyway, so we use to get pattern. All right, so that's set. We'll do that by using getting pattern up and running, and then we'll use the juice box for that. So that one's that one's allocated. Um, and also I have an idea. Now, with the vermin, you know, the uh, thing we grew over here, I believe, twitching voraciously, I believe that it said if we combine it with moth and food, it will accelerate further. <sighs> All right. We've got a moth one here. So, what we're going to do, you are a vegetarian. You are going to do that. All right. Feed the beastie. I don't know if that's actually going to help here, but we'll give it a try. All right. That's one of our twists. Right off the bat. And we need to feed. So, yeah, I was wondering, actually, if you could uh, serve these like you could tea, it would make so much sense. But no, you can't. And we'll deal with uh, tuppence in a bit here. Cluck, cluck. Don't worry. We'll feed you. We'll probably feed you one of the bags so I get a lot more space. Just bed them the... Uh, Let's get that over here. Over the organization. All right, cool. All right, so if we do that, um, we get the honey. 
over here. King's Luck High. I'll, I'll read that later. Yeah. Alright, so yeah, let's get this. And get these things organized a bit better. I don't even know what the hell I have, which is going to go a long way to getting the day done. Do, 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 do. See how close I can put these stuff down. Hey! There. There. Gods. Okay, so there and there. And there. I'm kind of a compulsive about stuff like this. You're going to have to bear with me. Not quite OCD, but not too far away. Anyways, so there's that. We've got um, the phonograph going. We've got the um, so we've got the purple stuff planned out. So we're going to need to grab our favorite just verse or pattern and then go around and read that with Fett, my guess. And this one's got rose, correct? Grab Fett. Just verse. That will get us the memory to point uh, knock one, which is good. Since we're not going to be doing any room clearing with a dude, why don't we just... Yeah, let's just get some cash. Oh my god, we're low on that. And yeah, what are we going to do? Are we going to... Okay, so... Hmm. We're going to need Wist. We're going to need another memory card for Winter. So the best one for Winter is, I think, Introduction to Histories. Yep, Foresight. We'll use other wrists for that one, but I think we can use that here. Yep. Grab that. That will get us a two-point winter one. Jeremy will have to summon with the big Fost. All right. So we are going to do this. All right, then. Diving in. Good Jeremy, we were thinking about it. Why we still got the courage. Go ahead. Sorry, Timothy. Um, there you go. Let's grab Timothy first, as he'll be the first to mature, as it were. And do 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 This is longer when you're watching it. Alright. Hello, Timothy. In about 60 seconds, but there you go. And actually examine him. Alright, he's the rector. Oops. Alright, so that's going on. Alright, so do we want to do a uh, chore and health we can obviously use for our collections. And we can use that either for the flower that we already have a bunch of. In fact, I'm probably going to stop at three for most flowers just because. Out of weirdness. Um, we've only got so much room. So the other thing we can do, we need to save one for uh, Terrence there. I think that's Terrence, right? Yep, Tuppence, sorry. And I'm going to have to use... Fire or health in order to do so. So we'll probably use health. And yeah, use chore, I guess, since we need less wood than we need uh, anything random here. To go uh go chill. Go have some fun. Find something interesting. It's there's not a lot to entertain yourself with in this island. I've got the most entertainment in it by far. But you know how it goes. I'll see if that actually increases anything. Yeah, the first hour or so in the, or a couple hours, like from between dawn and 10 a.m. is like when we do most of our work, because I've got all this stuff queued up. All right. Do 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 do. Pardon me, boys. At the chat tonight, at you too. Jack twenty nine. I don't think I don't think that song's gonna be invented for at least a decade. But we are in a temporarily unstable location. We've already established that in lecture one of the Hush House Lectures, which you know, if you're not watching, you should watch. Even though there's only one episode out right now. No, two episodes. That's right. All right then. Oh, I was kind of hoping Chimaric Lavra. Oof, didn't work actually. But oh well. I don't like you either. All right, Timothy. Let's talk. I want to talk to you about the state of my soul. It's very winter. We'll watch where it lights ahead. Boost winter and lantern. That's the thing about Watchmen. That's why I say it's part of the it's part of the conspiracies running this world. All right. So. All right. Cool. And. All right then. So we're gonna keep moving towards. Or cash. 
Very mending nets is what you do with fishing in the winter. That much I know. I did actually live in a fishing town for about half my childhood. But I didn't actually get close to any of them, because at that point, most things were... were most things were, um... Eh, more or less, you know, using machines instead of people. For, but in here, in the 1930s, we... Ooh, wait, wait. Did, what was that? Jesus, just like leap out at me there? Get, get back there. Get back. Get back. Back, I say. Back, I say. Oh, God. Books are... I mean, we know the books are possessed. I just didn't ever think that. I just think we had to notice. All right, so. Shaft. Uh, glass finger. Ooh, glass finger is all we got, though. All right, so it's going to be glass finger and... I mean, a memory. Memory, memory me. Remember me. All right, where's the skill? Various hunch. Bit of a waste since we were over two, but I don't have a juice pack. I honestly thought I'd have a juice pack. Only thing that might work. Well, we can technically put anything else in there, but I don't honestly know what we've got for a uh, for two pointer in. All right, just keep going. Yeah, chairs. I don't think those gonna work. Uh, damn. It has to be remains. I mean, I don't... We know the remains are stored through here, but I honestly do not think that we've got any amount of... Yeah. Well, what's that? Uh, honestly, that's a lot less common than this stuff. So, let's just... We'll just take the loss. I want the Curious Hunch back up and running. Okay. And continue. Oh, right. I can't do Terrence until after I'm done with the, uh... His, uh royal ship there. Alright, so... Yep. Snowflake candle. Silver something stopped as snow. Great. Alright, so... And Solomon's preparation. Awesomeness. We're gonna have to make a new one of those, I think. I think I have a spare one left up here, so... I gotta remember the recipe. I probably, probably won't get to making it till next episode, but yeah, we got, like... Uh, cordial. Right, we've Opened up the Smuggler's Cave, it's really going to be. My sister and I will be prudent, so we got four. Excellent. Now, what we need to do, get you the memory of me. Five. Okay, keep going. This leaves it memory. Boom. It's all with the memory. Excellent. Get back down to our listening, while he's recounting our memory. All right, singers, complete this skeleton. Uh, first of all, hang on. We should have checked this. Recording of a 1911 the performance of the Wings Beneath Winds. Wings Beneath Wings, the so-called visible opera. It's probably based off the other one we had. Remember the, the forbidden recording of it. Sky Spirit songs. The spinners complete the skewed airs beneath our skin and rose in Maya. Remember Maya is one of those cursed villages. Um, it's like the, I think it's the class 10 reusable vault, the one you get to when you run out of unique ones. But the visible opera is dedicated to friends with... Resurrect the bagpipe to lights and unexpected interruptions, right? You really shouldn't try to do anything regarding that. Anyways. Anyways, so what do we got here? Sea glass. Well, it's glass, which is awesome. We can use it to produce that metal. But yeah. Okay, cool. I love sea glass. Sea glass is just glass that has been out in the ocean long enough to um, become super smooth. I used to collect a lot of it when I was a kid. Going you know, the fishing village. Alright, so where's the glass? Um... Last collection, I think, goes up here because they're both all usually considered a material. Excellent. You just go right there. Awesomeness. Awesome sauce. Beach sand would have worked just as well, but you know, little variety is not going to kill you. My oh, God. Poor. My poor. My poor hen. Maybe calling him she, really, yeah. Obviously, the laying eggs are probably not the males. Uh. Alright, so. Lots more stuff here. All right. This, thing, this recording ends with a clamor of horrified voices, a grating metallic streak, and soft brass buzzing the phases in the blurring silence. So... They got attacked by a cyborg magpie? I don't know. Cheerful Diddy. Well, yes. And Sings and Strongs. We've already got level 2 in that one, so we're going to have to do some serious reconnecting. All right. What we can do... We must consider what, we're what we really need. See, we've got... I don't honestly need it yet, another... Okay, Magnifree, stitching and binding, but this one. Weaving and knotting. 
Let's call it Teenage Wolf. That's a little nuts, but we can deal with it. But we could. We've got health going. Okay, Toughness is going to have to uh, wait, unfortunately. Grab this, grab that. Put the Cheerful Diddy in place while we still got it. And we'll need health. And yeah, that one's enough to wait too, but don't worry about it. Okay, so I'll bring us to level two. That will get us to... Uh, three. Yeah, I really need to check that one out. But yeah, go for it. There you go. Consider that. All right, so more cash. Cash is good. Cash is king. Knowledge is queen. And I'm, that's really kind of a ridiculous statement. All right, so Rector. Your candle. I'll offer my sister a candle. Brings you up to six. Then I'll offer you a drink. You'll be at ten. You'll take care of the black and yard. And yeah, it'll be a day. Pretty much. Oh well. Larva should really have a place to chill. It's just not going to be anywhere near where I am. All right, so we have like a. Oh, you guys have got to have some. No, no. Okay, fine. You can have separate places. I really shouldn't keep it outside, though. Uh, sorry. God damn it. Make sure it's got a really secure cage. Very hunch. That's a hell of a bonus for a lot of work. Plus, it'll also work on an omen. Okay. Could actually use it for strength of songs, but it'd be kind of a waste. And we will hopefully be able to use it with that. But yeah, keep going. All right, so, yep, level two, excellent. Then we've got Timothy. Go for it. Everyone casts their own shadow. Well, ten. Take a drink. And we're gonna see what the hell Ground Zero look like after that, because, like I said, some captured magician decided they didn't want to be captured anymore. I don't know if they survived or not, but they certainly made an impression. Like all over everything. Side. Hmm. Got two lessons to do tomorrow, which is going to be, yeah, uh, maybe another catch-up day. So unless we can pull this again on him, and I've got to make some other Solomon preparation. Yeah, this goes. All right. Ten it is. A man. Bless this place. Put the spirits to rest and knock on the door. Do we got. And drags. I can't say I don't entertain him. And, you know. Okay. Why he's doing that? Ah, uh, Coco. It's this thing. I can't get the. Yeah, we've got. I need a better set of shelves or something. And yeah, this is. This will have to do, but at least we know where all of the EV ones in use are being used. Like the two Grail here. I mean, we can definitely make something interesting with that. I think there's a Thunder Skin. Add. Yeah, what do we have? That's one. You have art. Ooh. Only problem is we still don't know how to get. We still don't know how to get Miskist. Um, can't get any amount of this that we want, but it's not super powerful. But I'm glad to know it's got healthy red in it. Yeah, a little windy out there when he's doing his exorcisms, or probably last rites. Okay, let's go. All right, cool. Oh, that's that's not good. Um, no things, just the exercise yard. Oh God, prisoners in the cubit cubit curbit were permitted to grow neither too strong nor too weak. Here, they're such exacting regimes to both their bodies and their souls according to the governor's design. Yeah, the same governor who was stuck here with a curie that hated his guts. And yeah, this place, this place. This place is hell. All right, so got that. All right, the yeah, the frequencies we have are death, insight, or mercilessness. Actually, for oh yeah, death. That's edge and not lantern. Death, violent trauma, because that's the aspect of uh, this we're working with. Art for exercise and key, which is kind of a sick joke. But you can put one soul and one fragment here. You can use this to evolve Istathri. Great. I've, well, I Jeremy at least cleaned up. We, Jeremy just at least cleaned up the bodies. Uh, okay, blackened staff room. The stories are below. Seared below. Blackened falls. Furniture half consumed by fierce fire. Not the room remains untouched. 
And this is the worm eaten hall. Bears traces of the worms. The serpents there are no serpents. They're almost certainly gone, but will take no chances. Worm difficult to evict from buildings are much harder to evict from people. Remember those are the puppet parasites. And we cannot do Jeremy by himself with that. But we're off by one point. Unless we have a piece of footage that has one. Yeah, we're also risking his body being possessed by a thing. Just this. I just pull out a bit. Uh, that's it. Just this. I think that we got it out of a package, too. I mean, theoretically, we could do it, but I'd probably be better off waiting for a poet. And our totals here 96. And hey, look, I'm doing it. I can do math. Um. Ooh. And yeah, it's we're in tonight at this point. And approaching spring. Um. I really want to dig through here more. <laughs> I had much more interesting stuff going on than a bunch of bunch of self-appointed um, jackasses beating up on mages, because this is where you go when you lose to the uh, suppression beer, by the way. This is where you went. This is why it's after Cultist Simulator. Maybe one of those failed characters is the one that blew this place to pieces. Um, but it looks like he took out the entire tower. You go, dude. Fuck the man. Um, uh, I'm gonna get dumbtized to that, but it's worth it. Anyways, so yeah. Plans, plans, plans. Again, we don't have a lot of cash to work with. It won't, but we will have it when spring rolls around. When spring rolls around, then we'll be able to take care of that. I don't really have anything going on right now, so yeah. That's the thing. This is weird, but we can use remains in both. It's kind of cool. Uh, memory, yeah. It's interesting. We can use remains also here. Different type of sacrifice, though. So. Yep, see? Almost identical. Because both of these are elements of sacrifice, which is, they say, that it is all about burning something off. The One of the first rules of magic, power of anything, really, is sacrifice, which means that you get what you put in. Let's say... Ooh. How did I miss this? Sea glass, right? Okay. Missed the viper egg. I feel bad about that, because we are so... And I want a snake. Okay, so next episode, we're hatching a snake. So if that is doesn't get you some you people back, I don't know what to have, but yeah. We're gonna get a Mirand a Mirage Zoo. God, there's a fancy name for it. Marand Marangi. I've never actually heard anybody say it. I've just seen it read, so I have no idea how it's actually read. Raisin clock. Alright, that's cool. Um so Oh my god, you can move it. Anyways, I'm getting distracted. So yeah, next time. We did so well with this egg, why not do it with this egg as well? This is going to get interesting. Um, but yeah, we're going to start digging into the fall of the Suppression Bureau over here, which, you know, I'm all f I'm all for. Oops, sorry. Let's see what we've got for... Weather. We can start with hail. Alright, so we can probably use this to get back our um, thing. We can need oof, so much to do. Oh, there's many more soul fragments, aren't I? We're going to have to start diving into that. Anyways, this is the Curia Fantastic Worlds. Saying the visiting hours to Hush House are now closed. Hope you enjoyed your stay. Hope to see you next time here over at Book of Hours in Lovecraft Country. Make sure you stop by for the Lectern Hall. I mean, I'm not sure exactly where we're doing it because I don't actually see a Lectern Hall. I don't think we have internet here either. Anyways, I'll see you next time. Bye. Like to subscribe. I'd like to thank my Acolyte level supporters whose contributions help this channel grow and hastens the inevitable digital apocalypse and rise to the Dark Lords of content and data.